Welcome back to another video. My name is Callan and I'll be reacting to every single A24 film in order. Today we're on movie number 13, Tusk. Now I remember the first time that I watched this movie, I was really grossed out. I don't know if grossed out is the right word, maybe more like disturbed by the visuals in this movie. But I remember enjoying this movie overall, so I'm really excited to re-react and re-watch this movie. Before we get started, I'd really appreciate it if you please subscribe to this channel down below and follow along this journey with me. Anyways, with that being said, let's get started with movie number 13, Tusk. As always, starting off with the A24 logo, of course. Hey, if you want to watch Based this video, on please actual go to events. Website, What the heck? <laughs> He's got more hits than I do. I'm kind of in a weird way jealous. Mm. I don't need both legs. What am I? I'm not running marathons. Join us next week while Wallace sits down with the uh, one-legged wonder, the master of self-mutilation. You just sit your one leg down forever. Oh, <laughs> oh it's too easy, it was right there! I love that they got mm. the epic meal time guy. I don't really follow hockey. When you're visiting the great white north of Canada, you got your can of do's, and you got your can of don'ts. Right there on I've never flight. been to Canada, it's but right I've always wanted to, and I hope my interaction is as fun as this. You know what you see? Is this? Oh no, did the Kill Bill kid die? Oh, no. I gotta be honest, man. There is nothing weird about Canada. It is painfully boring up here. Hello. I'm an old man who has enjoyed a long and storied life at sea. Tonight would be... That'd be amazing, sir. Yes, thank you. Oh, that's right, such a great going? cup. Is Bifrost. that real? I hope that's real. Sounds erotic. If I need to go <laughs> and buy myself one. Okay, uh, how far is Bifrost from here? Bifrost? That's far. Is that yeah, Lily? Yeah, two hours from here. Wait, actually, Johnny Depp is also in this movie. But though I may be old, I have lived. And I will tell you all about my many adventures. This is what I aspire to in life, owning a giant house and having a billion stories to tell. Just make sure that I'm not a psycho like this guy is. What a giant house. Good evening. Mr. Howe? What is that scary thing in the Howe. back? There must be so many, like, creepy things and artifacts in this house. This. Thank you. You bet. Did he drug the drink, just like in our last movie, The Captive? Did I understand you correctly on the phone when you said you weren't looking for a living arrangement? Mm -mm. No, I live in Los Angeles. I'm curious to know how many other places he's placed uh, that letter, or if he oh, only had it in that out. one bathroom, in that bar. And though I cannot boast of legs that Functioning, yeah. they keep me ambulatory. I'm a storyteller by trade. I'm a podcaster. Podcasting I'm, has like significantly here. taken off since this movie was released. Uh -huh. This is gonna sound really weird, but I've never had tea like this. It's blowing my mind. I feel like I've never had tea in my life. That's because it's uh, drugged. I'm my cherry. Well, I became acquainted with a walrus when I was lost at sea. I saw my savior. I saw a walrus. And though I uh -oh, couldn't he's know to fade now. when he was called by his marine brethren. And for six mm -mm. glorious months, I was at utter peace. He was with that walrus for six months? It'll be all right, Mr. Tusk. He called him Mr. Tusk. I, if I bring you, you know this. Teddy gets weird and jealous, and then the show sucks. What your whistle might rather Is there more whistle? drugs in that cup? I didn't know what it was until I looked down and I saw this rather intimidating little spider crawling out of your back mm. leg. Oh, shit. Spider bit me? <clears throat> There's a doctor here? Yes, Dr. Moustier. I can't feel my legs. With the venom traveling to your heart, it forced the doctor to save your life, to take rather, as we say, drastic measures. Did they cut off his legs? Mm. Oh my god! Cut off one of his legs. Oh my god! He was making fun of the Kill Bill kid in the beginning for only having one leg, and here he is now in the same position, or well, worse position actually, maybe. I'll do everything I can to escape, especially seeing that he's in a wheelchair. I don't know how fast his electric chair goes though. He still has that chug a lug cup. This man can't get him like a normal cup. To keep it grown up the water This guy is crazy. Oh, he's able to stand and walk. 
He doesn't need that wheelchair. He definitely cannot run him now. I've been constructing a very realistic walrus suit. Mm-mm. This reminds me of Midsummer. Not an A24 accident, it's someone cheating in an A24 movie, and here it is. Uh, who is she cheating with, though? Is it his podcaster? You made me feel beautiful again. So look out, you crazy Canucks. Something weird mm. this way comes. It's gotta be Next him, right? Week, Wandering Wallace takes a raunchy road saw trip this up to the Great White North. You're a numbskull to cheat on someone that hot. Teddy, that's nothing to do with how hot she is. I know she's hot. But there's some top shelf ass out there who listen to us. Mm, so he's now. constantly cheating yeah. on her. Oh, it's his phone. Grab the phone, grab the phone. No. Yeah, hopefully he's able to leave a message, at least. Ellie, Ellie, you gotta help me. I swear to God, I'm not joking, okay? All right, at least he's sorry, able to leave a message, I think. Okay, okay. wrap it up okay, and then call the police. I don't want to sit here and cry all night. Yep, there it is, we knew it. Okay, answer the phone. Why aren't you answering the phone? At least he's able to leave a message with both people. Oh, there he is in the background. It's Howard. Your life as you knew it is over, Mr. Brighton. I don't know why the old guy was so careless in leaving the phone out there, you know, for him to use. Big mistake. All right, go check your phone. Go check your messages now. Someone's looking for Wallace. Interesting how his name is Wallace, which kind of sounds like Walrus. I wonder how many other guys this has happened to. Like, he seems to be pretty experienced with what he's doing. This can't be his first time, right? My father was stabbed several times with a mugger's knife, and my mother's throat was slashed as if she were cattle. I was beaten. I was tortured. So I guess it's starting to make sense so why no he's so crazy or why he turned out so crazy. Cry. He had all these bad he's things happen to him when he was younger. Man is a savage animal, Mr. Brighton. Mm. Better to be a walrus. Both his legs are gone and then now he sewed like some flap or I don't even know on his arm. Mm. He did his very best to make All the skin is just so gross. Walrus has never cried! Oh my gosh. This is quite a visual. And it's, like I said, it's so hard to look at. Oh, there's the H bar that he was at. The best of man by reality television. I never should. Did they not have a better picture of him? Going back to that story that he told when he was younger and all the bad things that happened to him it makes sense why he hates mankind and i guess would attach to an animal like a walrus i had a fella come in here from quebec two days ago asking about any legless bodies that might have turned up where does like all this extra skin come from and all this extra mass a walrus must learn to swim this is just insane Mm. Yeah, so he wasn't the first one. Ah, here we go. Johnny Depp. This is such a strange character. <laughs> is this restaurant real? I'll have to go visit it. All right, have a nice flight. They don't have these back home, you know. I might have to eat my burger like that if this place is real, just smash it down. It's crazy how, like, he's the only person with all this information, but because of, like, how he's acting, it's so hard to believe or trust him. I believe that two years back, I met this son of a... Interesting. Oh, did you come here by the spider? No. By the way, you know, I didn't even... Your name. You see, that was the name of the doctor, our parent you know, name I of the doctor. This man is making King a monster. I need some like behind the scenes of this movie. I wonder what like, because Justin's obviously in that suit. I wonder what it's like to be in that suit. I wonder what their reactions to seeing him in the suit were the first time, you know?
That is an mackerel. Yeah, so you eat a fish like that. Like if you're starving, I guess you have no other choice, right? But, uh, this is no. so messed up. Does he smoke the cigarettes? Does he chew the tobaccos or toothpicks? Does he drink the coffee? He likes um, big, goofy, convenience store drinks. That's so specific, oh but I love it. It's Mr. Mustache. The, the kids here at the convenience store are telling me that it's a boot two hours away. Great, got it, and um, I'm gonna leave right now. Look at so all that maple syrup, hours. I just noticed that. Good. One of you must give me the pad now. I thank you. Thank you very much. Do you have a pencil? He's lucky nobody else wrote on that pad previously, right? I think they should also call for additional backup, you know? You will fight me, Mr. Walrus! What the heck? Why does he have his own die? walrus suit? Except his is like an actual suit, it's not his body. Walking into something like this and seeing that, I would pass out, I think. How can they not be freaking out more? I would completely lose my mind. One year later, so they're at some zoo right now, or animal sanctuary. You already know, this place must not get visitors, or this must be like a private exhibit. There's no way. I got his cup. What a movie, man. This is the first A24 end credit scene. Yeah, just had to have the second slide. All right, and the A24 logo to close us out, of course. All right, so that was movie number 13, Tusk, hashtag walrus yes. This movie was just as disturbing as I remember it the first time. This movie and story was so ridiculous at times that I just couldn't help but laugh at just the overall absurdity. I really enjoyed the cast. I'm a big fan of Justin Long and Johnny Depp was just such a character. I really don't even know how to properly rate or rank this movie. I'm looking at Letterboxd right now and this movie is sitting at 2.5 stars. And I feel like this is a movie where you really love it and will give it like 4 or 5 stars or you just think it's so bad and ridiculous that you'll just rate it like 1 or 2 stars which is why it's sitting somewhere in the middle at 2.5 right now. I'm one of the people that really enjoyed this movie but I don't think it deserves 4 or 5 stars. So for me personally I'm gonna give this uh, even 3 stars. Now in terms of ranking it though I definitely enjoyed it more than The Captive. I don't know if it's better than Enemy or Lock though, it definitely shouldn't be, but I really did enjoy this movie. This is a tough one and I feel like I might want to rearrange this list in the future, but as for right now, I'm going to put this movie in the number 9 spot below Lock and above The Captive. So this is my current ranking of the first 13 A24 films. As always though, let me know down in the comments what your thoughts were on this movie, what you rate it, and what you rank it, and I'll see you next Thursday for the next video.